Yo, what's up, it's your boy Speculation Bag in one other video, man. So I wanna talk about this Kanye West situation, you know, uh with him and Kim Kardashian and a skit uh Pete Davidson, right? So I've been following the story, you know, like since the beginning, but I didn't wanna make a video on it. But you know, uh going forward right here, I feel like uh uh I should just address it, right? So uh I hear a lot of people saying, you know, that Pete Davidson is trying to antagonize Kanye West to say something about him, you know, uh, following like uh, the text that they have been exchanging, you know, when Pete Davidson said, you know, uh, when Kanye West asked him, uh, where you at? And uh, he said, uh, I'm in bed with your wife, you know, and a lot of people say, oh, oh, Pete Davidson is so petty saying, I'm in bed with your wife, knowing Kanye West is divorced uh, to that woman, you know, and they say, you know, uh, Ky um, Pete Davidson is trying to antagonize Kanye West like with that statement of saying I'm in bed with your wife right so but for me I'm looking at it in a different way you know if somebody is a celebrity you know and they have been they have been with somebody you know for most of their lives right and they recently like broke up and you are like the new boyfriend to the girl right you know and the ex-husband or the ex-boyfriend is busy like bullying you every chance he gets on the internet like everywhere like music videos like mind you like this guy has a lot of reach has more reach than you right in terms of reach i'm talking like he can go on different platforms and you know start saying shit about you like he makes music he's in fashion like he can do anything to bully you online and he got a lot of fans he's a very popular guy and he's busy like uh bullying you every chance he gets and you know some sometimes somewhere you like you will have to defend yourself right you have to defend yourself so i feel like uh pete davidson has been trying to defend himself but i feel like kim kardashian has been trying to you know or has been you know making pete not say anything you know she i feel like she has been putting uh a red stop on pete davidson from responding to kanye west but that reading those text uh messages you know between kanye west and pete davidson i feel like the one that said i'm in bed with your wife i feel like uh pete davidson didn't write that I feel like Kim Kardashian wrote that text. I don't know if I'm wrong or right, but I feel like Kim Kardashian wrote that text. I don't feel like uh, Pete Davidson has anything to gain by antagonizing Kanye West. The only person who has something to gain is Kim Kardashian. So what does uh, Pete Davidson have to gain from making Kanye West not see his kids? I don't feel like he has anything to gain. The only person who has something to gain, the only person who is going to custody court with Kanye West is Kim Kardashian. So I feel like she wrote that text to antagonize Kanye West to say, you know what, I will do this and this so that she can present those text messages to the court so that Kanye West loses his custody over the kids i don't feel like pete davidson has a horse in this race even though it may you know i feel like kim is using he's using uh she's using uh pete davidson a few months from now or just a few weeks the kim will be announcing that she broke up with uh pete davidson and what did pete davidson do for her she held he helped her win custody of the kids and who looks like a fool now pete davidson looks like a fool you know i feel like that's what it is so i don't know man like you guys just tell me what you think about this but i i, I feel like kim kardashian is playing you know uh he's on the uh, it's on the evil side when it comes to this i don't feel like uh we are being told everything you know, we don't know what's happening behind the scenes. We don't know if uh, the mother is involved, like uh, Kim's mom. I don't know if she's involved in this, but, you know, I feel like this is more to it than just Pete Davidson, you know.
but you guys just tell me what you think about this man and i'm out